Hola mi gente, it is Liz. Hey guys, hola mis amores, it's Ashley. <laughs> I didn't say that last time. <laughs> We're coming to you guys with a new video, so I hope you guys are excited. Well, I'm excited because like we make this because we enjoy what we're making like we said in the first video so if you haven't watched it you can scroll to our first video but our title if you haven't read it yet and you just clicked it because you like us um but basically <laughs> yeah we're doing a video talking about the struggles of twins and even though none of you asked I mean like I guess we kind of have a little bit of experience you know <laughs> <laughs> yes we, we have so much experience yeah. like like 18 whole years Almost, yeah, Because we, you know, started from the root, now we're here. Yeah. We are never alone. As in, like, you always have, like, a best friend. And since we have the privilege of growing up together, because there are twins that do not grow up together, which is something that people don't think happens. Like, parent trapped and all that. Yeah. So, like, basically, we had the privilege of doing that. We got to be close because, um, you know, financial stuff and all that. But, like, we got to know each other, like, know our differences, and we got to become friends, not just siblings. Yeah, like, for a long time, like, we were twin sisters, but we weren't actually friends for such a long time. And I feel like we became so close, especially during middle school when we needed it the most because of all the ish that happened all the stuff that happened in those years like it made us bond because we were going through so much stuff and it was so nice to have someone that not could understand me but that could just be there because my friends they would say they would be there but then they they wouldn't be like they would be present but then instead of helping you get over that situation they just literally they they make the whole situation worse by opening their mouths and trying to like change or make solutions but like sometimes when you go through hard stuff all you need is someone to listen to a shoulder to cry so that brings us to our next point which is um like experiences which is so amazing because since there's like obviously there's two of us like we have a sibling that's not that much older like we are in a, around the same etapa it does like, we're, we're the same like stage in life that's to make it makes sense it's yeah. like um for example like when we go through situations like if i go through it first i give tips for liz marie or if liz marie goes through it first then she helps me out like yeah. an example is um for her she was in an interview for like college and she helped me out for when i had an interview for college so it's kind of like that oh. <laughs> <laughs> so out like shopping and stuff even though it's not something that we do a lot it's something that we do like as a tree or just to hang out like after like we save money or go out you know and what i like is that we get to like sometimes there's certain clothes that like i want to get like let's just say just a basic shirt i can just ask her to wear it and then it'll fit similar obviously there's a lot of clothes that i wear that she personally can't wear because like the before uh, proportions proportions are like similar but they're not the same so yeah but like let's just say it's like a big shirt 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 like this one like i could just be like can you wear it for me or can you try it on since you're already in the changing room and just like pass her the clothes That's and it's really it's, it's really cool too because like like when we buy clothes we get to buy like more clothing if that makes yeah. sense because if we have the same shirt we both like we just buy one and then we can both wear it like whenever yeah. we want well we have to ask of course whoever wanted it first but it's just fun because we get to experiment like with clothing with and different style, style. Yeah. because like our style is a whole list but we're trying to get short videos out for you guys and in the future if there's you know more friends not more friends <laughs> more fam in this place then yeah then that's when we'll change some things but anyways the last point i will say for this part is that you have a friend and like like we, she was mentioning it before but it's kind of different because like you have a friend that's near you because like there's friends that you like or maybe next door neighbor stuff that never happens because you know new york city not it's very rare for someone to have like a best friend that lives oh. close or like twins that don't look that much alike us we happen to look a lot alike because we have very strong genes in our family so they arrange themselves in a certain mm -hmm. way um but like people think that you're the same person and it's really annoying because like people now that i'm reading recently when i mean recently like in let's just say the past five years i've gotten so close to them that they know distinctly like whether i'm not like wearing glasses have a different hairstyle or even if i dyed it like she dyed it recently yeah. not recently like eight months ago but i mean like kind of recent <laughs> so like how is it that those people know the difference between me and her and there's people who've been in my life when i mean in my life i mean they like, know of me yeah they, yeah for no so of us. like for how like 
was it like 17 ish more years of about us but they don't truly know who we are mm -hmm. and it's annoying like we get yeah. okay we're gonna get to the questions right now no like the questions that we receive at least uh they're like oh um ustedes son iguales like like you a guys question are the mark. same you guys are the same right that was they say in a tone in spanish you know the tone makes a question so they say and i'm just like why ask a question that you don't want the answer of and it's very annoying like just to like just to say the least it, it really is not because like i don't love her but like you know every you know everyone hopes whether or not they're a twin that they have their individual voice and impact on people so for you to say that i'm just like her what am i bringing to the table what is she bringing to the table if it's coming to her and it also messes with your identity like especially like growing well growing up in the climate of this world right now people tell you who they how how you should be and by saying that the same they're the same person you're just taking the identity of one of them away or taking that uniqueness out of that other person. And like, do twins run in your family? Does it skip a generation? Oh, like, do you have cousins that are twins? And then like, to answer this, and it's just like, to continuously answer it, and sometimes those same people that ask you it, ask you again the next time, the next, and the next, but then they don't truly want to Hear get you. to know you, because let's say like, one, they would just want to know one of like us, and now, both of us or if they want to know both of us they will only know us at, when we are together and not yeah. separate which is crazy because our our personalities are so different and the interests that we have are so different and like people don't take the time for that you know what i'm saying like that's what irks me the most about all of this so basically that's one sorry we went on a long tangent but that's one of the yeah. main issues yeah, that we go through one. we're on the third one actually okay so um most of the only thing that kind of annoys me is that like um most of the times when people go up to talk to me is because i am a twin and like and i don't mind because like obviously i if you have questions because obviously not everyone is born a twin like is there like they're like oh um like they'll ask like the questions we just mentioned and the one after this but like they'll just start a conversation because we're a twin so when in opportunities that we've had that we're not with each other and we meet people they're very shocked and like the conversation we could just be getting to know each other like each other's names like you know not small talk but but just like you know things that we genuinely like talking about like a passion in life that you have like in life basically you'll have it and then you'll mention like oh i have a sister she's my twin you know you mention it and then the conversation turns into you being a twin instead of the conversation that you have next point oh my god who's who's born first who's what? better who's the good one who's the bad one which one of you is the angel oh you look like the devil oh my god i see that look oh my god i get that so many times we're at the store i'm just like yeah. no i just i have added to with you because i don't know like sometimes these people have like um they're just shop like you know they go shopper frenzy kind of thing like people you pass by crazy. basically people you pass by so like we get that a lot and it's not like annoying it's just like the fact, like, even if there is a twin that is good or is bad, why do you have to label, like, label them? As in, like, yeah, their character can be like that, but they're, it could be the day that you meet them that they're acting a certain way. Like, when people become friends with one of you and, don't, and they don't know that you are, like, have a, another sibling that's your age and stuff, like, they let's say they don't like you, you encounter someone that doesn't like you because it's going to happen, right? There's 7 billion people and you're bound to find one that's not going to like you. And then that one person is just like, oh, I don't like you, so I don't like both of you. Yeah. And I've had friends that have come up to me and have said, oh, I don't, I don't want your sister to hang out with us. I just, I don't, I don't want her like here because I just don't like her personality. And I have friends that I'm like, if you don't want to hang out with her, you shouldn't hang out with me either, because it's kind of. Like, I guess it's personality, but you don't know her, you know what I'm saying? Like, we became friends for a reason. Like, you got to know me, and I feel like she's so different in a way that, like, for me, I'm a very, like, I would say I'm, mm, like, outgoing. I, I was... I'm pretty I'm outgoing, not. like, I always say hi to people, I go up to people. Now when I'm in a new environment, I wait like a day or two, and then I go up to people and I'm saying, hey, how are you, I'm Ashley, what's good, like, are, like, what's up, kind of thing, like, getting to know new people, adding people on social media, and while Liz Marie, on the other hand, is more, like, you have to come up to her, like, yeah, she will have a conversation with you, but you have to come up to Okay, sorry guys, um, we are back. And we already ever. <laughs> yes. Um. Sorry, the lighting got really dark in here. We did not expect it to happen that quickly, 
but we're just gonna recap this whole video for you guys so basically i'm gonna read off our handy dandy list so basically there's the struggles of being a twin there is like you're never alone that's a good thing because like you get to have that's a also friend. a bad thing we've had so much oh, disagreements yeah. and it's kind of like since we live in a small apartment when we're mad there's only so far we can go so yeah we have no choice but to make up sometimes to my mom one time wow. and she interrupted me oh sorry but <laughs> she um i i did that in an argument like we were like i don't know i hugged her and i started like i just hugged her and <coughs> i started laughing because i thought it was hilarious like her reaction she didn't take it the same way so like she got really mad at I me mean, after that okay end of story bye <laughs> um anyways <coughs> you get to go shopping with people like if your friend is available sometimes your sisters obviously we already mentioned before we're going into school and we're obviously gonna have different schedules work school all that stuff but like we're make we are taking advantage of the time that we do have and the time we're gonna have in the future because yeah. college well, we is not the end of life it's just like another time that you have to pass by and also gonna be so sad i'm only in one class with her and like yeah. that's a freshman like seminar or something so. Yeah, another the bad things or the things that really frustrates us is that people think that we're the same person. Redundant Those, questions, like oh, has redundant. to be the top, like redundant questions, um, and the rest of the stuff she will finish up. So it's like all these questions, like I'm tired of answering, and you know, in the future, if we make it to 100 subs, um, when we make it there, then we'll give a Q and A about what I just said. So then, um, people talk to you as if like you guys are one person as in like you guys don't have personality personalities um who's the older twin who's the younger twin how like who's how by how much i'm like that's really personal information like you want to know when i left my mom like is that really yeah. the question you're asking and i would say oh, yeah. exception. and then the most annoying part is that like who's a good or bad twin <coughs> there's not no good, good or bad <coughs> twin we're both good people some sometimes we have both have a difficult personality personality to deal with and it's just one of the things that we always have to deal with so i am so anyways but um i am so glad that we got to do this video and um we're just gonna like okay basically all in all i <coughs> love being a twin because it's something so unique and i have a privilege to meet such an amazing person that is obviously the better half of me I just I'm really glad that I always have a buddy to go with me everywhere and that gets my jokes I'm really happy because of that I, I, it's such a blessing to share these amazing years and to go through failures and successes together and it, it's just been amazing I really do love it and um like we've been like best friends i would say for like five years now <laughs> yeah, five, like five years, years even though we've known each other literally our, our whole, whole lives life. but like when we were born we were we weren't together and we'll get we should just do another video on that but we weren't together for a while and then we got yeah, together and when we got when we got together we were back and better than me okay give your input on how you feel like being a twin has like helped your life or how being a twin has been a good or bad experience, <coughs> experience. Yes. Well, I, of course, enjoy being a twin. I have no other choice. That's how I came into life. <laughs> but like, I mean, I am so thankful. That hurt. <laughs> like I had no other choice. <laughs> no, but we did it. Like clearly, yeah, yeah, it was our parents who had a choice. Anyway, <laughs> I am so thankful to have this beautiful girl next to me. And then most of you in the comments, but you guys look alike. It doesn't matter. She's beautiful to me as in personality. Like, stop looking so exteriorly, okay? So then, basically, um, I'm so thankful for it. Um, there's a lot of problems, a lot of situations that have occurred because of it. Uh, it's helped me grow, grow as a person, and I, like, can't, I'm so ready to see what is, like, ahead. In because, store for us. Yeah, because we've been through a lot, because it's the most we've ever been through, but the least I guess in our lives because we still have so much ahead of us. If you haven't already, if you viewed our <coughs> video, please subscribe, well if you want, if you like this video, please go subscribe down below, it's the red button, just like every video you've seen before this one. You know where the click bell the bell. Is. If you wanna click the bell, go ahead and do that. If you don't want to, that's fine too. Like the video if you liked it, if you dislike it, go ahead and do that too. <laughs> no, it's okay. Wherever you are, come on. Wherever you are. <laughs> no. no, I'm just kidding. Okay, whenever you okay. see this video, I hope you guys okay, enjoy. Bye, you guys. Bye. bye.